Welcome to this video. This video is to show you how to include or embed a Google Forms survey on your website. So similar to sending your survey, so this is an example of the survey I've made, an ice cream survey. Uh, similar to sending your survey by email right here to participants or just sending a link. This option is very easy. You just click on the third option here. It's, this is called embedding HTML code. So this HTML code you can copy to your website and essentially uh, basically put the survey on your website, your personal website. Okay, so very easy. Click here on the, this little symbol right here. Then you'll have the uh, embedded code here. You can change how big uh, the survey is or appears. I will not be changing this now, but this is an option. Now you can click on, you can copy paste from here or just click copy down here. Now the next step is to go to your blog or your website and input this code onto the website itself. So here, uh, this is my uh, blogger blog website. Now I'm creating a new post. Uh, I've written the title of my post, Ice Cream Survey. Please answer my survey. So now here I'm in what we call the Compose view. So if I copy paste, this will not work. <laughs> so basically this is the code. You need to input it in, on the, in the HTML itself. So I would delete this. Click on, again, this little um, pencil pen right here. Switch from Compose view to HTML view. So now under uh, my please answer my survey HTML code, I would copy paste the code for my survey right here. And this is saved automatically. So what you can do is go back to the compose view. So I would again click here on this little symbol, compose view. And now it's there. Um, unfortunately, you cannot see it before publishing. But if you see something like this, this gray box, it means that the um, the embedded code will work. Okay, so now what I will be doing is clicking on publish. Okay, I will publish this and let's see if it works. Okay, let's let me go to my blog. Let me refresh my web page, and here it is. Yes, so uh, my survey is available on my website. So uh, again, oh, maybe this was a little bit big, but anyway, it still works. So uh, do you like ice cream? Yes, you can answer. Again, multiple choices. They can, answer, they can give multiple answers. Drop down menu, choose uh, here, a linear scale. Um, I like eating ice cream with friends in the summer, nothing else. Um, when is the last time I can choose a date? It was yesterday. What is the best time? Um, maybe in the afternoon, one o'clock. New, a new name for an ice cream shop, Super Ice Cream. <laughs> the best name. Okay, and here, of course, they could type their answer for the last question. Okay, and then submit. And then they should get a response. If I scroll back up, yes, your response has been recorded. So I sent this information to the owner of this Google Forms survey, which is in this case, me. Okay, thank you so much. Um, I will be producing another video to show you how to access this data. If you're interested, please find the video on my YouTube channel. Again, thank you so much for listening and hopefully this video was helpful.